1949. That was the first sea fair followed immediately by the next year by the hydros. Normally the hydros are here. So I'm in Genesee Park at Stan Sayers Pits. During sea fair, this place is a complete zoo. It's very quiet now and it's going to stay quiet this summer. It's our annual party blowout. Sea fair has happened every year since 1949. The hydro started in 1950. And this will be the first year without sea fair in any form since then. The Blue Angels are a little more complicated. They started in 1966 with sea fair, but had to take a break here and there for various reasons. When that goes away in one fell swoop, it, it just kind of hits you hard and tells you this is where we are right now. Last year, our own Kim Holcomb from Evening was the Seafair Queen. And technically I still do because, you know, the whole plan was to coronate someone new this summer. Back in the day when I was a kid in Seattle, there were two big days a year, Christmas and Seafair. And hydro legend Chip Hanauer, a big part of Seafair for decades. It's, it's our block party. It's our company picnic. It's the best weekend climate wise. If you look, it's the best chance of a great weekend in Seattle. But if anything, maintaining social distancing at Seafair would be, to say the least, challenging. That's not to say they didn't try. We tried to work on different uh, ideas. What can we do plan A, plan B, plan C, and plan D? Because we know how much Seafair means to the community. Patrick Harrison is the organization's spokesman. As things started to evolve and change and became more of a reality, it just wasn't able to come together, whether it be through social distancing or through sponsorship or just a combination of everything. It was just not something that we could really pull together. And we thought it'd be better to just completely reschedule for next year and come back even stronger in 2021. So Patrick Harrison says, they may not be totally out of sort of weapons to bring to this battle. They say they, they are working on trying to do some other small scale events, maybe get one Blue Angel over the summer. Uh, they say expect maybe some news on that, but nothing's nailed down. And Seafair, of course, the major Seafair, which really starts with the fireworks on July 4th, and that's off for this year. So we'll see what happens, see what they can bring back. Live in Seattle, Glenn Farley, King 5 News.